A hypoallergenic dog breed is a dog breed that is more compatible with allergic people than our other breeds. There is also a view among experts that, there is no basis to the claims that certain breeds are hypoallergenic, and while allergen levels vary among individual dogs, the breed is not a significant factor. However, breeds that shed less are more likely to be hypoallergenic. People are allergic to the dander that sticked on the hair and not the hair itself. Researchers have shown that frequently bathing dogs, frequent cleaning and vacuuming of the home, using air filters, restricting the dog to certain rooms, and adopting a small dog are the best measures to remove allergens from the environment. Generally, it is said that the luck of the few with their pets cannot be stretched to fit all allergic people and entire breeds of dogs. It should be noted that there is no standard for a dog breed to be categorized as hypoallergenic. This list is more or less about dog breeds that shed its coat much less compared to the rest. This video is made based on the consensus opinion on purportedly hypoallergenic dog breeds. Let us begin. Poodles The Poodle is an active, athletic breed with the different breed varieties varying predominantly by their size, is also one of the most intelligent dog breeds. Poodles are often cited as a hypoallergenic dog breed. Their individual hair follicles have an active growth period that is longer than that of many other breeds of dogs. This, combined with the tightly curled coat, which slows the loss of dander and dead hair by trapping it in the curls, an individual poodle may release less dander and hair into the environment. Poodle does shed, but the fur gets tangled in the surrounding hair, which may lead to matting without proper care. Yorkshire Terrier The Yorkshire Terrier is one of the smallest dog breeds of the terrier type, and indeed of any dog breed. They are very playful and energetic dogs. Yorkshire Terrier, also known as Yorkie, do not shed to the same degree as other dog breeds. The Yorkshire Terrier coat is said to fall out only when brushed or broken. Bichon Frise Bichon Frise is a small breed of dog of the Bichon type. Bichon Frise do shed minimally, however they shed very little in comparison to most other dog breeds. Regular grooming removes loose hair and dander that builds up over time. This is a hypoallergenic dog that is born with a single layer coat. And when it reaches the age of one year or so, its top layer, also known as the guarding hairs, will begin to grow through. Because of this and his tight curls, shedding schedule is different from most other canines. Maltese the modern variety of Maltese breed of dogs traditionally has a silky, pure white coat, hanging ears and a tail that curves over its back. The Maltese does not shed. This breed is kept for companionship, for ornament, or for competitive exhibition. The Maltese does not shed, make it ideal for those with allergy to dog hair. Also the Maltese dog is a very small dog, commonly referred to as a toy breed. This means there is less of them to produce the allergens. Spanish Water Dog The Spanish Water Dog breed is a medium-sized dog, bred as sheepdog and guard dog. It is also used sometimes as a gun dog and is skilled at retrieval from water. This loyal, affectionate, and intelligent breed usually acts like self-appointed guardians of their house. Their curly, woolly coat is low maintenance and doesn't require frequent brushing. Clipping the coat once or twice a year should be enough to keep it tidy. They have a single coat, which means no undercoat. This lack of an undercoat means that they don't shed much. They can still lose hair sometimes, but they are considered a low-shedding breed. Lagotto Romagnolo this Italian origin dog is of small to medium size, powerfully built and of rustic appearance. They are suitable for people with allergies as they molt very little from their soft, fluffy, 
Sheep will like coat, making them a hypoallergenic dog breed. They have a double coat of hair rather than fur and shed only minimally, although they may leave little tufts of hair once in a while. Shih Tzu Shih Tzu is a dog breed originated in Tibet, and the word Shih Tzu means little lion. These are tiny dogs with a big personality. This breed does not produce a lot of dander. Shih Tzu is a moderate shedder. Afghan Hound Afghan Hound is selectively bred for its unique features in the cold mountains of Afghanistan. Their long, fine textured coat requires considerable care and grooming. The long topknot and the shorter head saddle on the back of the dog are distinctive features of the Afghan Hound coat. Afghan doesn't have a thick undercoat, which otherwise exacerbates allergy issues. Dander levels are low with the majority of dried skin and dead hair becoming trapped in the coat, not deposited outside. Moreover they have low drool levels. Basenji Basenji is a breed of hunting dog originated in Central Africa. Basenjis are small, short-haired dogs with erect ears, tightly curled tails and graceful necks. Basenjis are minimal shedders. They have low dander, shed very little, and even have a tendency to groom themselves which make them hypoallergenic. Kerry Blue Terrier The Kerry Blue Terrier also known as the Irish Blue Terrier was originally bred to control vermin including rats, rabbits, badgers, foxes, otters and hares. The coat is the key feature of the Kerry. It is soft and wavy with no undercoat. The texture feels like a combination of fine human hair and wool. It does not shed, but continues to grow throughout the year. This makes them hypoallergenic. Kerry Blue Terriers need to be brushed on a daily basis. Here ends this video. For more such interesting videos please subscribe to our channel.